G'day friends and welcome to our very first DSP card kit to go. Um, this is just something a little bit different. Um, it's Vicky Wright Independent Stampin' Up! Demonstrator Australia. So every couple of weeks I will be releasing a um, card kit to go and it will be mostly um, retired product, well mostly DSP actually, um, with current or retired stamp sets and product. Um, I will have um, a limited number of kits to purchase um, and in each kit will include a sketch layout for what we're doing today as well as two card kits that you can create using this sketch, um, the same sketch layout. Now, the sketch layouts you can use over and over again. So they're all one page. So you'll be able to print it out and file it away for future use. Included in the um, um, the page is the photo of the card, the sketch layout, a list of supplies, um, and the video link. It doesn't include measurements. Okay, so um, just a minute, I'm just going to try and straighten this up. So I'll have the link down below where you can purchase the um, kits. But once they're gone, they're gone. So this one, I've actually got, I think I've got four that you can purchase. So it's basically first in, best dress, as the saying goes. Okay, so this is our card we're going to be creating today. So in saying that, just remember... You can um, use, you don't have to use what I've used. You can use um, what you have in your stash um, because you'll have everything to do to create your card except for stamp images, inks. It's just your basic card stock to create your card. So... There will be no stamped images as per Stampin' Up! policy. But in saying that, as I said, you can use what you want to use. Everyone's got something lying in their stash. So I'm just grabbing a couple of things just so that we can be ready. So we're going to be using the Dragonfly Garden along with the Dragonflies Punch. Okie dokie. So it's a pretty simple card. A um, little bit of... little bit of colouring. But you don't have to colour if you don't want to. You can use what you want. So this will be your kit. Now all the details will be posted below. Um, including the link to purchase your kit okay so I'm using the um, cottage gingham is it yep um, DSP which is now retired um, but as I said most of the kits will be retired DSP. Now, you can use either side of the DSP. It's entirely up to you. I've used this side. Um, I will admit this is one of my... I loved this um, DSP and I still do. So, And I love the colours in the pack. Okay, so what we're going to do is... Actually, cut this. Oh no, we don't have to. So you've got a piece of scrap paper in your kit, and we're going to stamp um, 
for a true friend okay and that's going to be in basic grey now I've teamed the, this colour up with basic white and basic grey so I'm just going to go out of sight for a moment I always ink my images or my sentiments first <coughs> excuse me and scrap onto scrap stamp onto scrap paper first so I know that it's nice and straight so just bear with me a little bit crooked so let's do that again well it's way crooked <clears throat> oh, I've got a frog in my throat today still crooked. Hold on, just bear with me. I'm just going to grab another piece of cardstock. I don't know what I'm doing. That's straight. So why can't I stamp this straight? This is where I should be using the Stamparatus. correct in the first place so then all we're going to do is stamp or stamp cut adhere this to that to the basic grey I'm actually going to trim this back a bit it's just a little bit too narrow uh, wide for me so even if you're not happy with any of the trimmy, I mean the widths in your kit, you always have the option of trimming them back to what you like. Now I'm just using um, multi-purpose liquid glue. I love this stuff. And we're just going to Bring that over there like that so that there's a nice little just a tiny little edge showing okay then we I'm not going to worry about the ends yet you'll see why in a minute Now these kits will be released randomly but they will be in my newsletter so be sure to subscribe to that below so that you don't miss out. Um, unfortunately the kits are only available to Australian residents. Okay so we'll just trim this back now. Just like that. Then what we're going to do, oops, sorry. I didn't tell you how much they were, did I? So all kits are $9. You get two kits, um, the embellishment if we use embellishments, and it is it also includes postage okay so as i said all the links will be below then we're going to bring in our basic white and as i said me being me i always forget 
my bone folder. So I'm just going to burnish that score line with my thumbnail. You could always use a ruler as well. Now these kits are probably even um, perfect for a beginner stamper if you're just starting out. If you don't have stamps, you could always use stickers if you have them as well. And where I've got the dragonfly, you can use anything you like. You don't have to have the same images or and sentiment as what I've got. You could create two cards with totally two different um, um, images and two different sentiments if you like. Okay, so then we're going to bring in some scrap card stock, which I think I have, yep. And we're going to stamp our dragonfly in Memento Tuxedo Black. Scrap that. I'm not pressing hard, it may sound like it. I'm just making sure I get it a nice crisp image. And that's pretty good. Now, I'm colouring my image with the Stampin' Blends Daffodil Delight Combo. Um, you could leave the Dragonfly um, um, uncoloured or you could colour your image, if you're using the Dragonfly that is, or any image with good colour pencils or pencils. Okay, so we're just going to come in. I always use the nib end. Everyone's a little bit different. Way. Just like that, and again, we're coming in with our nib again, and I'm just in the bottom of it. Now don't forget you can use whatever colour tools you have or you can leave your image blank. Depends what image you use. You don't have to use um, the stamp and blends and you don't certainly don't have to use um, the dragonfly. Now I'm just coming over the top with my favourite colouring tool, Wink of Stella. Just gives a really nice shine and shimmer to your images. Now, I don't know whether you can see that, but it is nice and shimmery. And then we're going to come in with our, butter, our Dragonflies punch. And we're just going to punch that image. Just making sure it's nice and even. Oops. Around all the edges. Just like that. So that's our little image. Now, as I said, you can use any image you like. A punched image, a punched flower, die-cut flower, stamped flower. And 
then what we're going to do is put that aside for the moment. Um, what am I doing? I'm going to put adhesive down the middle just a little bit, just like that. And then I want to look, I want the image to look like he's flying a little bit. So I want to pop up one side of the wings. Okie dokie. So I'm just going to use the ends of these. Um, See that shimmer? Pretty A. Eh? And then all we're going to do is just put that down. Whoops. We don't want it to cover our. I might put it like that, just like that, and that's it. And then what? We, so I always leave these hang loose, and these this side looks like it's popped up. Well, it is popped up. Then we're going to bring in our bling, and we're just going to finish it off with a couple of um, wand stones. Oops, just grab my juvie decker. Put one, oops, one there. One here. I'll put one there, eh? And that is our card finish. So, as I, as I said, if you wanted if, to purchase these kits, follow the link below. And um, grab your kit because there's only a limited number. Everything is included in the kits except for the stamped images, um, but everything else is included, okay, including your inside, which we will do now. Forgot all about that. So what we're going to do is grab a piece of white and we'll do our envelope too piece of white and we're just going to stamp our dragonfly once more just like that now i'm not going to color this and while we're here i'll do a um oops envelope too now the envelopes aren't included Okay, you'll ha just have to supply your envelopes, but everything else is. So we're just going to stick this to the piece of basic grey. Just move it a little bit. That's why I like the the liquid glue. You've got a little bit of wiggle room. Now I've got six kits available for this card, and you get two. Two kits included in your kit, okay? Two 
enough supplies to create two cards. Okie dokie, so that's our card for today. So click below and grab your kit. Okay, thanks very much. I really appreciate it. Thanks. See ya. Hooray.